Are you looking to have a new electric service installed? Let's walk through the process. Submit required paperwork. In order to get your new electric service started, we require an application for service, a load checklist, and a site plan. The application for service provides us with the basic information we need in order to create an account. The load checklist helps us understand the electric load that is planned for this location. Knowing this information is crucial for us to properly size facilities and equipment to meet your demands. Your electrician may be able to help complete the service requirements portion. The site plan is a drawing or a sketch of your property. To properly design your new electric service and choose the best path for buried electric cable, ACEC must know ahead of time where you're going to place your meter. Identify as many things as possible on your property. It's important for us to note the location of all existing and future facilities, structures, and other potential obstructions. Clearly mark a meter point at your site for ACEC to measure from. Consult with your electrician or building contractor regarding potential meter locations. If you need assistance in choosing a meter location, an ACEC distribution design technician can meet with you on site to discuss location options. All forms must be received at our office before a site visit can be done. These forms can be found on our website, www.acecwi.com slash new hyphen construction. Step two, site visit. Once we've received your application, load checklist, and site plan, an ACEC distribution design technician visits the site and designs the job. After we've mapped out how the electric service will be installed, we'll send you an invoice, excavating permit, and any additional required forms. The excavating permit gives ACEC permission to install facilities on your property and covers liability and responsibility for all other underground facilities. It also gives you the opportunity to warn us of underground obstacles we need to avoid during installation. Note, the meter socket installation and inspection is your or your electrician's responsibility. Once your meter socket is installed, it must be inspected by the inspector for your municipality. A list of township inspectors is available on ACEC's website, www.acecwi.com slash inspection hyphen info. Step 3. Complete Obligations Once you paid fees and submitted a completed excavating permit, any other required forms, and ACEC has received inspection, it's time for ACEC to schedule your installation. Step 4. Installation of Service ACEC installs the new service approximately 2-3 to three weeks after all member obligations are met. That's the new service process in a nutshell. If you have any questions, please give us a call at 800-831-8629, Monday through Friday from 7.30 a.m. to 4 p.m. Or email us at acec at acecwi.com.